Hello and welcome to the show. I'm here on Forza Horizon 2 for another versus the community and this time out we are going to be driving the fantastically crazy super stadium trucks. These vehicles are absolutely fantastic. The real life racing with these is bonkers. I highly recommend you go check it out on YouTube. They are <laughs> they are just ridiculous vehicles and uh, we've got 12 of them that we are going to go racing around Storm Island checking out some of the most difficult off-road terrain you're gonna find in Horizon 2 and look at this we've got proper parking going on it's uh, <laughs> so nice to see such neatly parked stadium trucks it won't stay neat and calm for very long I can absolutely guarantee that with uh, <laughs> with these vehicles we will have a weather uh, to whatever we're going to have um yeah we will uh, <laughs> We will get underway. These are strange vehicles to drive. They only have three gears. The diff seems very open. First and second gear are basically spin. You spin and spin and spin the wheels, and uh, you know, not a lot seems to happen. And then third gear is kind of useful, and then there's no more. There's no more than third gear. I assume it's because these things don't partic go particularly fast in a straight line, if you like. They're more built for surviving the rigorous off-road conditions that, uh, that or should I say, the, the jumps that they have in the uh, some of the stadiums that they go to, uh, or some of the tracks even. Was it Adelaide? They had these racing around, a V8 supercar support race thing. Was it at the Sydney Formula One? I can't remember. They, they had them and they put up big jumps for them to deal with. Uh, <laughs> And so on. So yeah, they got tend to have soft, bouncy suspension. Uh, in real life, the cars will corner on three wheels and we'll be looking at the sky most of the time. Unfortunately, as much as I've tried, I can't get them to corner to look at the sky, but they're still quite wibbly and quite wobbly and yeah, sort of half jelly car. We are starting uh, around the uh, the mid pack. It's not too bad. I'm hoping that we don't have too much of the crazy into the first turn. Uh, in fact, amazingly, everybody's all got round here very, very neatly. Woo! -hoo! Big sideways moment, and then the minute you slam on the brakes, oh, uh, now uh, it's, it's not it's not been neat anymore. There's uh, <laughs> the crashes and bumping has begun. Oh, cars everywhere! It's uh, <laughs> very hard to keep track of where I've got to get rid of that bloody menu. Go! I don't know. God damn it! The the score thing is completely and utterly in the way of the rearview mirror. What is the point in a rearview mirror if you're going to cover it up? We need more visit. Oh dear. That's going to... No, we're fine. We've got a big bounce. Oh, we may not quite have the brakes. Uh, fortunately, neither did the truck on the outside. Oh, <laughs> get a bump on the inside as well. Oh, no, no, no. There's, there's likely, there's always a lot of bumping, shall we say, in Horizon. There's, there, there's tends, or there's, there's likely to be more bumping when we're driving these sort of things. The visibility. <laughs> It's so difficult to drive sometimes from, from cockpit view because you just end up looking at the sky. I'm pretty sure there's a truck trying to get to the inside of me that I just can't see. We could do with some... I I do apologise, truck. I'm very sorry there. Uh, <laughs> we could really do with some... I can just about vaguely see out of the rearview mirror. I want wing mirrors. We could really do with some wing mirrors. That's very sideways. We're uh, exploring some more. Oh, this is about the most sideways you will see me whenever <laughs> when I'm racing something, probably. Oh, the... <laughs> We're taking another knock. Uh oh, we go. I think we're too wide. Ah, crap! I've hit a building. We've had a minor incident with the building. Now everything's going to go flying past. Uh, is it safe to rejoin the track? I have no clue. Uh, I thought I could get away with taking that slightly tighter, tighter line by the building. Apparently not. There's, I think it was an electrical box or something that I got stuck on. All uh, right, it's starting to go towards nighttime. Uh, yeah, these have lights on the front of them. I assume they do anyway. Uh, yeah, they do. I think. Uh, I'm like it. I love these trucks. I, I like racing sort of slightly crazy vehicles, and these are pretty much the definition of utterly bonkers off-road cars. So, yeah, <laughs> I like them. And actually, to be fair, the racing has been pretty close for, for Horizon 2. The racing <laughs> is pretty damn good. Right, we're going to ooh, run wide. Not as wide as the truck ahead, though. We might make up a position here, although I think he's going to still be on the inside. We're very, very sideways again. It's too wide. No, it's not too wide. I'm well ahead. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, the, the slight lack of sort of visibility around them is a little bit difficult, I have to say. Uh, can we go for a sixth place? I'm where I started the race in seventh. Oh, just look at the floor. There we go. Thank you. There. <laughs> Whoa. So <laughs> someone's utterly not made that turn there. That was... Uh, 
That was Rush. Um, they may have had like a controller turn off or something. That's uh, that has happened. Before. It's happened to me actually in a very old versus the community. God, what was it? I was driving a Corvette Stingray. Coming out to the first quarter at Sakuba, and my controller just died, and it went straight on, and I killed about four vehicles. It's something that happens. It's uh, <laughs> one of the uh, one of the dangers of online racing, shall we say? Or to be fair, at that quarter there, if you've got the bumps wrong and your truck decided it was going straight on, uh, there is bugger all that you can tell it that is going to stop it. It is going straight on there. I think these are, these are a decent speed when you can actually put the power down and stop sliding the buggers. Stop, slide, there we go. Uh, <laughs> yeah, if you get it wrong over the jumps, if you get it wrong with a car over the jumps, you tend to go flying, but in these with such soft suspension, they bounce, and they do bounce quite high. Oh, duh! <laughs> <laughs> could we not do that, please? Could we not have cars spawn? Admittedly, it was in ghost mode, but if we could not spawn in the middle of the road, that would be lovely. Uh, right. Oh, now we've got a whack on the uh, the rear corner. That's going to give us a big slide. Oh, we good? Don't know where the other where where the truck that hit me went. Oh, there it is. Uh, <laughs> oh, I love these things. There's another truck missing check. Everybody did so well at not missing checkpoints at the start of this race, and then it's all got a bit to pot. I'm not sure Night Racer, I don't know if they, oh, they do do Night Racing with these, or kind of Night Racing, they, they have them in the, the big dirt tracks, I'm pretty sure I've seen them race them there at night, although they're quite floodlit as well. Uh, if I remember, the one I watched anyway was, uh, we're not making that turn, we're going to bump the wall, where many a truck has gone off in this race, I would assume, through there. We've got about four trucks lining up behind us, we are in fourth at least, which is not too bad. The other guy, the cars ahead are miles gone, I've not had the cleanest of races. With the whoa, no, 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 you silly thing. Uh, I want more rear end grip. Oh, ah, oh, something's gone, come, uh, got past. Now, can we do a cutback on, on him as he goes wide into the turn? We're trying to get to the inside. It, I'm leaning on him a little bit, I will be honest. There is a little, <laughs> little bit of leaning going on. That is a huge drop. Uh, I think he's still on the outside. I don't quite, I'm going to try and give him as much space as I can here. Where is he gone? I've lost him. I don't know where it is anymore. I'm just going to go. He may have. Oh, I think he may have missed a checkpoint. Whew. I came home in fourth in the end. <laughs> Not the, the quickest lap times. Um, yeah, quite <laughs> quite a bit of the pace with these. I'll take a fourth place, though. Uh, just by staying out of major. I've had little bits of trouble, but by staying out of major trouble, I could. Uh, <laughs> Somehow, somehow get into uh, into fourth place. Oh, uh, I forgot about the big jumps on that track. Okay, I'm liking uh, I'm liking racing these already. There should be more racing with uh, with the stadium trucks. Eighteen thousand credits, not bad payout as well. I don't even know how far off I am the next level on here. Could we get a level up and have a wheel spin that gives me about three thousand credits? Oh yeah, we will have a wheel spin after the the next race. Hmm. Okay, I'm thinking. I'm thinking we're going to go to the uh, the Forest Brawl circuit, if I can find... Uh, where is it? It starts up. It's somewhere... No, that's not it. That's it. There we go. Forest Brawl circuit. What a fantastic circuit this is. Probably my favourite track on the entirety of Horizon 2. I do like this layout for, for off-roading. And these trucks, with the huge jumps that are around here, I'm hoping for spectacular crazy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's the plan. Again, we'll, yeah, we'll stick it up to five laps. Uh, these, I don't know how well they fly through the air. I don't think I've driven this truck at this track. Certainly not done a huge number of laps with it. So I'm not sure how it flies. I'm hoping... <laughs> I, I'm hoping I'll be at the back for the first lap and I can come around and I can just watch as everybody tumbles over. That would be a... Uh, <laughs> could be quite a spectacular sight as sort of... Uh, <laughs> 11 stadium trucks have issues over the uh, over the jump that could be interesting um right uh yeah i don't mind if you start me at the back of the grid for this one i'll be honest game uh if if you're going to start me at the back of any ones here would be fine with me uh i do i should have a small advantage i've di driven this track so many huge number of times you see when i say i don't mind being at the back you put me at the back if i say i'd quite like to be at the front you put me at the back it's my <laughs> My curse with Forza. Uh, it is... Uh, I, I don't know why. Forza, Forza just hates me when it comes to uh, to random grids. Okay. Let the... Uh, let the racing begin and let the silliness of all of these trucks go flying around uh, commence. I got a better start than that truck. I might just leave it in the third and see how that suits it, to be honest. I may have missed that. I did miss that completely. Uh, there was more grip than I expected, goddamn. Ah, uh, bugging it up completely. Um, 
Yeah, I'm thinking that if perhaps if I just leave, I mean, around this track, third should pretty much work the entire way, because there are no tight corners, and if I drop it down a gear, I think you just spin the wheels, and then you're just wasting time. So I'm thinking third may be a potentially good gear. Right, how do we take that one? Where? Oh, I've got the... <laughs> There's... Oh, no, that somehow that counted as me going through the checkpoint, and I have no bloody idea how, but I'm going to take it. Let's not question it. Forza apparently has taken a slight more liking to me. Yeah, I definitely missed that one as well. It's not been a good start to the... Uh... <laughs> to the race. I'm not quite expecting as much grip as there is in these. Um, yeah, I think third gear is just better because you don't get the wheel spin. Admittedly, it does feel like it's bogging down a little bit through there, but uh, I think it is, is better than better than nothing. Oh, the big jump. Well, the big jump actually wasn't quite as spectacular as I'd hoped. I think the suspension kind of slows it down almost a little bit as we run up the hill. Uh, ooh, and then break, and then break, and then hopefully get it turned in. We're going to sneak up the inside of something. Fantastic. And we're going to sneak up the inside of another thing. We've moved up into what I think is now ninth place. I guess someone may have missed a checkpoint somewhere that uh, I didn't see to uh, to get past. Ooh, then we're going to not slide around here. We're going to behave. I said behave, truck. Listen to me. We may land on the back of the car ahead. No, we're just <laughs> I got a really, a really big run up towards that jump. Oh, uh, I do like the fact that we are. Oh, okay. No, maybe we're not really dealing with the bumps quite as well as I had. Uh, <laughs> I had hoped. I was thinking with a nice soft suspension, we should deal with these bumps. But it's kind of clattering the the floor quite a lot. It's not really cushioning it much better than some of the silly vehicles that I've driven around here, like Shelby Cobras and Ferraris. Have I driven a Ferrari in the I can't remember. Oh, here comes the rain. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, the various crazy vehicles that have raced around here, they've cushioned the bumps, I think, better than this does sometimes. Oh, we've got <laughs> A little bit of bouncing. There's a really exciting group up ahead that I want to catch, but I think I'm going to run out of laps now, which I'm, I'm very annoyed that I missed the checkpoint at the start. I was trying to do that. Tree! Oh, f ah. <laughs> I saw that. Too late. Oh, go, go. Please go. Please go. There we go. We're, we're going. We're, we're moving. We're moving forward, at least. It's basically going to be the battle for eight now for, for me. That's it. The battle for eighth and fastest lap. That's what I tend to do. If I end up slipping back through mistakes or uh, whatever, if I get crashed off in a race, I'll tend to then just go for can I get the fastest lap? If I'm if I can't get victory, I may as well may, may as well focus on uh, on that one. Yeah, it's a shame actually because it does look like he's uh, having a bloody close race up ahead. Oh, big slide! I'm opting for this line. I tend not to like to take the cheaty lines. I know. Oh. <laughs> may have given. May have given that truck a bit of a nudge. Um, I know, sure, it, it, on horizon, especially if you're off-roading, take whatever route you like. I'd still tend, especially with a, a race where there is actually a circuit, I still tend not to like to cheat. I don't really like cutting corners <laughs> on here. It's just inbuilt racer sort of instincts from, from various games. I, it just it doesn't come naturally to me to, uh, <laughs> to be cutting the corners like that. Um, yeah, so you will see on most of the sections. I mean, like on here, sure, I'll go to the I'll go to the inside of the track. Of course, I want to take the racing line, uh, but I won't tend to go massively off the road to uh, to get it or to, to take a different line through a checkpoint and so on. Uh, right. Oh, I think there's a car's fallen back. Just looking at the little mini map. Oh, I'm still having struggles uh, around here. Get a, I can't really get a good run out of that turn. Now we're heading towards the trees. Oh, okay, thank God, there's a barrier there. Barrier saved me life. Uh, <laughs> oh, somebody's had an off there. I think somebody. I don't know. Don't know what happened. I guess they. I think. Well, my guess would be they hit the the landing of the jump a little awkwardly, and that is uh, all it takes to uh, <laughs> to cause issues with uh, something as quick as this and as bouncy as this one. Uh, we're all taking apparently the bush line. You're going to get yourself in real trouble out there. You don't want to be playing in the trees. That's that. Uh, <laughs> That's a really quick way to uh, getting stuck. Uh, we are side by side, though, I think. Oh, no, he's fallen, he's fallen back behind. I'm up into eighth place, I think, at the moment. Okay, we're going to have one lap to try and go fairly quickly. I'm not sure if this third gear tactic is working or not. Uh, we'll have to see on the lap times if this uh, if this tactic is working. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> that would If I'd had much thicker paint on the back of my truck, that would have been uh, trouble for me. Okay, trying to be neat as I dare, or as neat as I can, sorry, and as fast as I dare through these turns. 
I do tend to like a little bit of a wider line through there. Well, it's only with a slidey vehicle like this one is. Try and get a good run out of the turn. I can't be flat out down there. Uh, <laughs> we've had cars doing 100 miles an hour through that corner. Admittedly, it is raining, so there is slightly less grip. This is doing 72. I think it could go a bit quicker. It wasn't really an ideal line. But uh, it's just these bumps. <laughs> the suspension is too soft. It throws it too much uh, around the course, and that causes problems. Uh, ooh, turn. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure that this was a particularly... <laughs> 93,000. <000. laughs> that is a big skill chain. from. That's me racing. That's not me trying to do anything. That's just from racing. Uh, most of that would be from airtime, a little bit of sliding, uh, lots of wheeling, and we crossed the line 17.1. I don't know how on earth you are. <laughs> Everybody's in the 17s except for one, the other one three. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure about that one. Um, in fact, everybody else's lap tires were insanely close down there. That's, uh, <laughs> that is probably the closest I have seen lap times between drivers in a versus the community ever. Between that number of drivers... That is, uh, that is pretty spectacular. Uh, right, XP, we'll get another 20,000. Look at that. We're getting some decent XP now. If we can go and win, well, uh, <laughs> win not much, I would, uh, <laughs> I would hazard again. Now I've said that we're going to win nothing, it may actually be impressive. We will go do this. Bugger it. We'll go do this now. Screw it. Otherwise I'll forget. If I leave it to the end, I will just completely forget, as I normally do with stuff that I say I'm going to do in a video, and then it just slips my mind. Yeah. No, they could have given me the Corvette, but no, we get the little amounts of money. Okay, so we are going to... I'm going to do a cross-country. We shall do... We won't go up that area. We'll go somewhere different. Find one of the cross-country circuits. That looks like a big one. Yeah, let's go give this a go. The uh, the cross-country circuits, with, vehicle, well, with normal cars, I should say, these can often be uh, a tad dangerous, especially... On, uh, on Storm Island with such huge jumps. I'm hoping that these may survive the jumps quite nicely. Uh, but as, as you saw, that the bouncing around can be their downfall. Either way, it should be utter chaos. And that's what we're going for. That's what we tend to go for anyway with, uh, <laughs> with these things. We go for utter chaos. I shall try and not miss a checkpoint this time, and I will try and be involved in a massive battle if there is a massive battle. It's always disappointing to be <laughs> to sort of see where there is a big battle on track, but having sort of having made a mistake, you're then too far back from the uh, from the battle. I love how the batteries. I've just noticed the batteries are hanging out over the rim. <laughs> they don't look particularly secure. I will be honest. For <laughs> the punishment that this goes through, they do not look as if they are exactly secure. In the, uh, in the back of the truck there. Oh well. We are starting again mid-pack. I'm not sure where's the best place to start with a cross cut. You probably want to be th first or last. In fact, with lots of Horizon 2 races, first or last is best. First means you can probably get away. Last means you can probably avoid the chaos. Uh, if there is chaos, of course. If there isn't chaos in your last, well, you're going to have a bit of a long race ahead of you. With these, there's going to be chaos. Uh, <laughs> the, amount of, the amount of wheel spin off the line. Oh, that's a big jump. Oh dear God! Uh, <laughs> we got attacked. Uh, <laughs> which way are we going? This way. Okay. Fortunately, the cross-country checkpoints tend to be quite wide, so you can often uh, get away with uh, a little bit more uh, incidents, shall we say? I don't know what. Oh, we're on. The, we're doing the. We're doing the three wheeling around that corner. I think the way the corner's banked and downhill will certainly assisted the truck in uh, in doing that turn. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, getting aerial attacked by something, it, it, it doesn't help. It's really not a, uh, not a fun, not a fun thing. Oh, no, 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 come on, turn. The understeer is immense through that turn. Oh, we're crashing through some more stuff. Uh, <laughs> I want one of these trucks. I just, you can just go absolutely anywhere you point it, and it will go anywhere. With, it makes a great noise. I think they look fantastic as well. And uh, it'll go there very, very sideways and just about in control, only just. It's just uncontrollable enough, un uncontrollable enough to be silly, sorry, but still controllable enough to be raced, if uh, if that makes sense. Oh, I was thinking that was going to follow the road round. It did not. Oh, bloody hell, we're going over here, are we? Ugh. Maybe second gear might have been good. Well, that truck's... Oh, no, he got out of the trees. Well done for, uh, <laughs> for avoiding that. I'm not doing particularly well with these trucks, I will be honest. Uh, not, not at all. <laughs> uh, it's just too much fun. It's too much fun to uh, to mess about with them. Okay, the rain is is coming down yet again. I'm hoping we're going to have a few more problems with or 
other trucks, not me. I don't want any more problems. I'm hoping some trucks will have problems with this jump. See, I got it lovely and smoothly. Look at that. There was a big clonk on the landing, sure, but uh, I think we've made it up into fifth from that. Yeah, there's loads of trucks. Probably had a bit of a tumble. Oh, no, 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 no. We're very wide. We're just destroying the scenery. It's fine. Oh, someone's wheelie bins are gone. The, <laughs> the bin men of Storm Island. Uh, imagine trying to drive a garbage truck around here. That would be... I want to do that now. I want to... <laughs> <laughs> Try and drive the garbage trucks around here to pick up the, the rubbish from the few buildings around. That's a job and a half, that is. Uh, <laughs> oh, dear God. We've got, we're not really turning. Kind of the front wheels are spending too much time in the air there. Whoa, get out of the signposts. We're really wrecking the place here. They're going to have a... <laughs> By the time we come around next time, they will have put all the signs back up. They will have replaced them. Are we up into fourth? We are. We're up into fourth. Again, by being consistent. Well, I say by being consistent. Or by not falling off the road, which like, like we've just done now. That was what I was trying to avoid. I think the truck behind me may have followed. Oh. <laughs> we got a jump start. That's one way to do it. Uh, <laughs> thank you. That was very useful. Now we're leading the big train of cars. Well, a big train of cars, at least. Right. We will uh, uh, be very, very sideways. I was trying the third gear technique to stop it spinning its wheels. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It still spins its wheels. It still slides around all over the place. Whoa. No. No, there we go. We've got it back under control again. Right. Now take the big jump. Don't touch the steering as we leave the jump. No, we've not quite hit the jump correctly. We've gone for a tumble and a tumble and a tumble. And are we good? Only, uh, <laughs> only three of them this time. God dear, we can do better than that. Uh, <laughs> bloody thing. I was trying not... That, that was exactly what I didn't want to do. Oh, okay, we're going to tack that corner backwards. It's reverse entry. Not, in, not quite the way it's supposed to work, but uh, it was a reverse entry. Now it's my turn to have all the bad luck. It really does just seem to be potluck. Can you, uh, can you find the precise right point to uh, go off a cliff? Uh, if not, you're going to have a very, very big accident. Uh, and if you can, then you're fine and can make up lots of positions. We're going so wide out here. No. Bad stadium truck. Oh, dear. Uh, we might have saved it. Uh, we're fine. <laughs> yeah. That's not uh, that's not traditionally how you get good, good lap times out of a vehicle. I will be honest. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. No, bad truck. Come on. We're going this way now. It's all gone wrong. We were up in fourth at one point, and now we're in... Well, we're still in seventh, at least. Uh, the field is maybe not quite as close. I'm not really surprised by that. Uh, when you do these cross-country races... Oh, I think I may have missed that one. Yeah. Ah, fine. <laughs> oh, now we've dropped all the way down to 10th. <laughs> I would have scared the crap out of somebody there as uh, my car reappeared in ghost mode up there. But damn it. Now, I've got to hope that other people have problems. Perhaps five laps wasn't such a good idea for this... <laughs> For this place, that was just default. Uh, avoid the trees. There we go. That is just the default thing when I'm doing these races. Three laps is never really enough on most of the tracks here. This is just a little bit longer. So, yeah, uh, three laps probably would have done. Although I would, I would be intent. I now have a chance, a slim chance, admittedly, of uh, making some improvements. Now, going off to the left that way didn't work. The right, uh, well, it worked better at least. We didn't tumble. Uh, oh, and I see some trucks ahead of me. I see... I'm not sure what positions. What have we got? Uh, oh, there goes... Uh, <laughs> back down into 10th uh, into place. But I see 7th and 8th. We might be up the inside of someone's truck if we can turn this bugger. We have. I think they may have found the trees. Oh, we've found a group at the back. At least we've got some, <laughs> at least we've got some trucks around us. Nothing worse than just be circulating completely on your own with no chance of catching up to anybody or no chance of having anybody to, to race with, if you like. Uh, oh, that was a big slide. Perhaps being just full throttle down there wasn't such a good idea. Oh, no. We're bouncing. Oh, arse. I think we missed that one. Uh, nope, we're fine. <laughs> the game has decreed it's fine. Well, let's put it like that. We did miss that one, but the, it was close enough so that the game is okay with it. We've made it up into uh, eighth place as somebody else missed the checkpoint. Many, many missed checkpoints here. Uh, ooh, all right, we're all right. We were, oh, maybe not. Landing. Bounced a bit sideways. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, these cross-country races. Look at that sky as well. That doesn't look pleasant. I think there's a truck going around the outside of us. Well done if you make that move stick. Oh, a little bit of bumping. Okay, not quite as well done, but still. Uh, to be fair, they probably have absolutely no idea 
quite where I am <laughs> with the uh, with the lack of visibility. Oh, I tried to be clever. I've not been clever. I've not uh, <laughs> I've not been very clever at all. There, we have bumped a tree. Now, uh, one more lap to go. I think there was a truck around us somewhere, and I'm losing complete and utter control of my vehicle. Oh, look at that lovely flight path. Only I'm gonna find a tree. Ugh. <laughs> we kept it out of the tree. We're still fighting a little bit. I don't know if I overtook a truck or not in all of that. We may have done. We, might have, uh, we are in eighth. I have no idea quite what position I was in beforehand. Please turn. There we go. Uh, let's have a look at the map. There, uh, There's miles to the vehicles ahead of us. We've still got one fairly close behind. <laughs> uh, I highly, highly recommend racing, the <laughs> racing these trucks. Chances are if you've got Storm Island, you've probably driven these uh, plenty. They are... <laughs> They are excellent, excellent vehicles. Uh, ooh, we might make up another place here. Oh, someone's be, he's been braver than I going uh, going full throttle down there. Someone's already bloody finished. God damn it. Uh, no, no, we've lost another position. The rain's starting again. It's just been... <laughs> it'll be one rain shower after the next. Uh, oh, crap. No, don't go over that way. We want to hit this jump nicely. That's uh, pretty nicely. Oh, we got a big impact on the nose. Someone lost, lost, spun their truck. I'm going to dive up the inside as there's only a second left. I think I got the position. I did! <laughs> Seventh place for me. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> these vehicles. Uh, yeah, the cross-country races were about as spectacular and about as silly as, as I expected, really. Now again, I'll take another 26 there. I got more, almost more money from that race than I won from the from the wheel spin thing. Another 14,000 XP as well, not too bad. Okay, we are going to have one more race with these crazy, crazy vehicles. I'm thinking we will go to... where should we go? I kind of prefer doing a circuit race over one of these point-to-point -point ones. Um, or should we go for... <laughs> Shall we go for... Okay, fine. We'll go for a cross-country point-to-point. I'll just ignoring absolutely everything I just said. I think this is the one... Is this the one that goes through, through the temple area? It's quite a fun little ending bit to it. Bugger it. We'll go for it. Uh, <laughs> uh, there are going to be many an upside-down truck, I fear. I'm, fa I'm, fa I'm fairly sure there's going to be many an upside-down truck. Uh, right, let's uh, have an enter into this. Yeah, we'll keep all of that stuff on. I'm actually just curious, how much horsepower does this thing have? I'm suspecting it's going to have sort of four to 600 horsepower, something like that. Uh, there we go, 600 horsepower, 3,000 pounds. It doesn't actually feel massively heavy when you when it, when it comes to driving it. It's just the, the way that it moves around on the suspension. That's what's... Uh, that's what kind of uh, makes it a, a difficult vehicle to drive in many ways. The way that it twists around. Uh, it makes it a unique vehicle. I don't think there's anything that quite drives... Like, okay, sure, jelly cars and so on that I've built myself. Yeah, they drive interestingly, but I don't think anything else quite drives like this thing does. Uh, oh, look at that! The game has been so very kind to me. It's uh, <laughs> got me very much... Look at that. Ah, uh, Now, can I convert a pole into a victory. Chances are no. The chances are that this is not going to work and that I will fall over the second we get to a jump. But uh, maybe if I'm lucky I can uh, scamper away at the at the front. Right. Okay then truck. Are we going we go the first thing we're going to do is uh, take a huge jump. <laughs> no. I told you. I called it. We we're going to roll the first jump we hit. Uh, oh dear, I think we were going to be okay and then we got hit by everything coming past. Ah! <laughs> we landed almost pointing the right direction. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, it's not gone well, this, this cross-country race. I should have stuck to what I know. I should have gone for circuit racing. Never mind. Uh, oh well, we had a very big off. Oh bloody hell, we're going to go for another one. Two. Oh, we're going to just about land that. Uh, we've got a big... We've got it getting all of the knocks, but the knocks were helpful, actually, in sort of sorting our truck out there. So thank you very much for the uh, for the assist. And then we're going to go down the hill. <laughs> spectacular, spectacular cross-country course, I give it, this one. I don't remember particularly driving this... I don't remember driving a route with this many big jumps in it. Oh, make the turn. Just got it. Oh, that's going to hurt. <laughs> the bumps are ferocious. 
And now we're going to have a spin. I'm just going to keep it planted. Oh, if there hadn't been a tree there, I would have saved that. <laughs> oh, well. Arse. This one's not quite gone so, so to plan. Yeah, getting screwed over at the start doesn't help. And then bumping a tree. There was, oh, look at that. Tarmac. For the briefest of seconds, we found some tarmac. And I don't know if that was more tarmac. I was glad they were indestructible. They were destructible, sorry. Uh, I don't even know where I'm going anymore. Where am I going? Uh, <laughs> there's a checkpoint. There, there's a checkpoint. I found one. <laughs> found where I'm going again. You know what? We, we don't need to go around them trees. We'll go this way. This way makes more sense. Well, it's a slightly shorter route, although there is lovely, lovely tarmac up here. Oh. <laughs> And then we very quickly fall off the lovely, lovely tarmac. I could do with some more people having some some accidents, having some some moments that would be kind of useful. Oh no! Stop bouncing towards the tree line. There we go. We're okay. We've survived all of that. Uh, yeah. I'm, I, as much as I am enjoying these trucks, I don't think I'm particularly quick with them. It's. Uh, oh no! Oh, for God's sake! Oh, we just save that before massively overshooting the. Uh, the checkpoint there. Yeah, I'm, I'm not particularly good with them, but they are bloody good fun to drive. Uh, where on earth is this course going? We're going to have another... The race is already... <laughs> I'm not going to finish. I can tell you that. This isn't the race that I thought it was. It's not the one that, that uh, drives up towards the, uh, the temple and through that through that area. A little bit of a shame. Uh, we're going to have a spin, I fear. No, I got it. Oh, we might just make the finish line. Go on, truck. We can do it. Woohoo! Across the line. <laughs> <laughs> I meant to handbrake and I pressed the change camera button like a fool. But, uh, yeah, there we go. That is it for some uh, some stadium truck racing. Yeah, I highly recommend you give it a go. And mate, there was, some really there was a really close race in there um, for a couple of the circuit races. The cross-country ones get a little bit crazy, uh, as is slightly to be expected. It is the, the huge jumps that uh, end up having the vehicles fall over. But you can have an awful lot of fun with these vehicles when you go racing with them. So I, uh, I highly recommend you give it a go. Anyway, that is it from me. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. And until next time, uh, goodbye.